your page and your channel just ain't right. They just ain't right. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? It's me, your boy, Malik, back on your screen with another tip for the tube. If you want a Google Plus page that's not the same as your real name or your profile name, you want a Google Plus name that matches your YouTube name, something that's special, unique, and goes along with the brand that you're trying to build, you need to watch this video. I'm gonna jump off into YouTube and show you how to get it done. A lot of people out there have their YouTube channel connected to a Google Plus profile page. Now, if you wanna have a branded Google Plus page, a page that matches the name of your YouTube channel, then you have to set up a new Google Plus page and then you can go ahead and connect your YouTube channel to that. Or the other option is you can just change the name of your profile page on Google Plus which a lot of people don't want to do. They want to have a separate profile page for their, you know, their name, their true name. And then they want to have a branded Google plus page that matches their YouTube channel. This is for those people, those people that want to have the profile page separate from the YouTube channel branded Google plus page. All right. So what you got to do is you got to create a brand new Google plus page. So once you're signed into Google plus, you want to go over here to the home button and you want to go down to pages. When you click on pages, you're going to see all of your branded Google plus pages. So you want to go down here to the bottom right corner where this little plus sign is and you want to add a brand page. So you click on that. Type in the name of the page. Make sure it's the same name as your YouTube channel. If you have a website, add it here. And then you want to select whether it is a product, a brand, a sports, entertainment, whatever type of page it is that you have. Then you want to click the box that says you agree to the page's terms. If you want to read them, click on them. If you already read them before, don't worry about it. And then click on create page. Then it asks you to verify your account before you can start using it. You can get a text message or a voice call to verify the account. And then you want to click on continue. Then you want to enter in the verification code that was sent to you. and click on continue. And now you have the new Google plus page branded page that matches the name of your channel. So now you can go ahead and change over your YouTube channel to this new branded page instead of changing the name on your Google plus profile. So let's go to YouTube and make sure you're signed into the YouTube channel that you want to switch over to this new branded page. Click on your icon in the upper right corner. Go to YouTube settings. Then you want to click on advanced. And then down here under the account information section, there is a link that says move channel to your Google account or a different Google plus page. Click on that. 
Enter in your password. Click on sign in. And now it shows you how your channel is now. It says my YouTube channel on the left, and then it has the Google Plus pages connected to on the right. If it was my profile page, then it would say my name or whatever. And that's not what I want to change. I want to move it to a new branded page. So I'm going to click on select desired page or account. When I click on that, at the top, it'll have any branded Google plus pages that are not connected to a YouTube channel first, which is the one that I just connected. And then it'll have any branded Google plus pages that are connected already to a YouTube channel. So I'm going to choose the one that's not connected to a YouTube channel yet that I just created. Now it shows me what it's going to look like after the move. And I just click on move channel. They don't say, are you sure you want to move your channel from that Google plus page to the new Google plus page that you created? And I'm going to say yes by clicking on move channel. Now it shows that my YouTube channel is now connected to the new Google plus page. And guess what? It went ahead and made sure that since the page wasn't the same name, it changed it to the same name as the Google Plus page. But remember, it's not going to change any of the naming for you because you're going to be setting up this new branded Google Plus page as the name of your YouTube channel anyway. So they're going to match up perfectly. And once you're done, just click on OK. And you're done. You're all set up. All right, my beautiful YouTube peeps out there, if you like the content that I'm bringing to you, do me a favor, click on the thumb, the one that's pointed in the upward direction, comment. You know I love comments, and I'll always get back with you when you leave me a comment. If I can't help you, I'll point you in the right direction to get you the help that you need. And last, but definitely not least, if you want more YouTube chunky, funky goodness, then you got to subscribe to San Antonio YouTubers. If you don't subscribe, you won't know when I upload a new video and you'll be missing out on that chunky, funky goodness. All right. So make sure you click on the subscribe button and I'll see you again soon.